I have seen The Hunger Games, The Ballad of Songbirds and Snakes, and I'm allowed to give you a brief reaction right now. As always, context first. This reaction is coming from someone who is one, a big fan of the film franchise, and two, a book reader as well. So this reaction is coming from the perspective of someone who is familiar with the source material. That is where I will begin, because one of my biggest criticisms of the movie is something that I did catch myself wondering after I finished the book. Will they split this book into two films? While I do very much understand why they chose not to, what we do wind up here with is a movie that is two thirds excellent, really effective, and does have a very clear and powerful conclusion to it. But then the movie does keep going and the remaining part feels a bit rushed and underserved. It does play well enough, but it is noticeable that this movie is two thirds really, really damn good, and then one third so-so. Digging into the cast now, I thought Tom Blythe was quite good as Coriolanus. It is not easy playing the protagonist of a film who's got a deteriorating moral compass where you have to keep the viewer invested and engaged from start to finish, but also be able to effectively pepper in cracks of judgment all throughout the story, and he pulls that off quite well. I also absolutely loved Rachel Zegler as Lucy Gray Baird. Again, a challenging role, and for a number of reasons, but a really big one being that she needs to be able to show off that infectious bubbly quality that the character has, that innate theatricality, but do so without ever undermining the severity of the situation she's in and the fear that comes with it. And I just think she was spot on in that respect. Also briefly, Viola Davis was almost too good as Dr. Gall. I loved her in that role. And I thought Hunter Schaefer was exceptional as Tigress, just the perfect example of someone taking a minimal amount of screen time and making the absolute most of it where your eye is always drawn to her. You want to experience more with her and spend more time with her. Perfect casting right there. And now because this winds up being the centerpiece of a Hunger Games movie, or at least a Hunger Games movie that involves games, I will say that the material that unfolds in the arena is excellent. I thought it was riveting, vicious, and extremely well paced and edited. I loved how well that material served the characters in the arena and also the mentors outside of it. I feel like oftentimes with storylines like that, you wind up with audience members falling for one more so than the other, but that's not the case here. They're both well served and the editing flows quite well between the two. So I thought that was very well done. Overall now, I will call The Ballad of Songbirds and Snakes another winner for the Hunger Games film franchise. Again, the last third is not as strong, but it's good enough. That first two thirds though, excellent. 